shit. Why didn't my chair pick my champion for me, yo? What? Why do I have a 30 minute? What is up with that? Why is that a 30 minute penalty? I thought it was 5 minutes for your first offence. That seems cruel. Does that not seem cruel? I haven't dodged on this account in forever, I think. I can't remember the last time I dodged at least. Alright, let's just go on another account. No worries. Sorry for being AFK, I was trying to find some shorts to wear, you know. We, we're kind of upgrading. We were just sitting around in our pants and now we need to sit around in our shorts. But we got a um, Q dodge and a 30 minute penalty for some reason. It was our first dodge, I don't know why we got a 30 minute penalty. Either way, we were looking for some shorts, we ended up dodging. And so now we're playing this account, which is Plat 2, I think. <laughs> you guys thought I was AFK, I'm not AFK, I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> Alright boys, my lease has been pretty good, but it definitely has its flaws. So, let's try and uh, continue with the parts that were working and improve on the parts that sucked. Alright guys, <clears throat> I've got this garbage skin on right now, Victorious Elise, it looks terrible. Elise has to be probably the only champion in the game where every single skin of hers, bar one, is worse than her default skin. Legit, I'd rather use her default skin than this skin, SKT skin, uh, Blood Moon Elise. I don't like them. They just look weird in spider form. You look fine as a human, like you look okay, but then as a spider form, what's this about? <laughs> what is... <laughs> They even fucking, they went down summoners on that shit. Come on boys, what's wrong with that? It's a bit weird because I could have just camped this vein, that would have been fine. But I guess Galio is pretty, I think Galio is better in the 2v1 than that vein is. So I guess to that extent it's a smart-ish strategy. Anyway, I want to try and camp uh, vein a little bit. Because she's quite vulnerable, she's uh, being top lane by herself. But also I want to camp Orianna. Orianna has no defensive summoner, so... She should be a lot easier for us to kill. Most Orianna's run like Ghost or Exhaust or Barrier or something. Not this one. This one runs Ignite, so she dies. Good to get a Yasuo snowballing as well. I've got a feeling Gragas might show topside soon. If I were Gragas, I mean Gragas would be around this area just from his jungle path. So I'm just gonna put some vision down. In fact, I could go and gank top before they put wards down. Oh, fucking hell, you scared the shit out of me. Bloody hell. Hmm. Not sure about this one. Ah, fuck. I'm so dead. Nowhere to run, nowhere to hide. <clears throat> At least we killed Tristana. Spending a lot of time ganking, not farming right now, but if I get stuff out of it, it's fine. And when your mode boots are least, you always get stuff out of it. I have two stacks of smite up now, it means that I, uh, if I want to counter jungle, now's a pretty good time to do it. If you counter jungle with smite up, it's a lot safer because you don't take as long to kill the camps. Because obviously you can just smite them. I probably could have, yeah, got Vayne as she was coming back here. I'm just going to wait for my Q before I attack her here. Beautiful. Don't know where Gragas is here, and I'm out of mana, so if I want to go for something here, it's a bit difficult without mana. But I would like to go for this blue buff if possible. Gragas is topside, this is fine then. I can probably get here a whole bot side jungle here. I mean, we also want to go for this tower, right, I guess? Holy fuck, get wrecked. Poor, poor Vayne. This is how you camp someone, holy moly. God damn, Vayne. Would be nice to try and snowball the bot side pressure we have here by going for things like Dragon. Because while they've only got one person bot side, like with Vayne and we've got this tower down and stuff, it's, we can probably take this. Gragas is also spending a lot of time top side right now. So he's not really going to be here to contest this, I don't think. I don't think we win a 2v2, do we? We might do, but I'm not sure. I'll tank it. Can someone get her? Oh my god, she's not dead. Fuck, I was waiting on my repel. Oh my god, that wind all sucked. 
Shit, that was so close. We did that so well. Yeah, I was hanging tower for so long there because I can repel to drop tower aggro. So I wanted my team to be able to chase for as long as they could there. Under tower. Fuck me. Can my spiders even get him here? Oh my god, I missed my stun. I wanted to eat a brand to just smite the vein there. Fuck, this game is going to shit. G game is going to proper shit here. It's not good. My cocoon, the last fight was really a big problem there. I don't know whether it changes much because Oriana actually joined the fight. That's what killed me, but it's still bad to miss a cocoon like that. Might survive for a bit longer. Might be able to turn on brand, for example. I also missed, I actually, I missed a cocoon before then on vein as well, didn't I? So I missed two cocoons there. Really? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I would get it if I wasn't someone who could just stun him, but fair enough. That was really good. He fucked her up pretty hard there. <clears throat> Let's see if we can get Vayne here. They're gonna go for this dragon. I'm not sure there's much we can do about that. I'm pretty sure it, like, it's probably warded in that tri bush, right? Just pop it instantly, bro. It's whatever. I think we get her still. Okay. Right, Gallo still gets an assist on that. Even though all we did was use his ult. <laughs> Fair enough. Right, you can solo Rift Herald just by running around it as well now. I legit had no idea you could do that. I always thought you needed to two-man it. Lucian's gonna want it though. <laughs> he did all the hard work, so he definitely is gonna take that. Just gonna get some, like, farm here. I need to keep farming. I don't want to fall behind on that front. And my whole jungle is up right now. So it's pretty bad for me to just, like, be running around and fighting when my jungle's up. I'm on a lot, sitting on a lot of gold as well, so... I should go and shop soon, honestly. 2k gold is a bit too much for me to be sitting on. But I can't recall just yet because I know Lucian's going to put Rift Herald down soon. And if he puts Rift Herald down and I'm in spawn, we're going to lose so much pressure. Yeah, I'm fucked. Yes. No, he has no ult. Fuck. Yeah, that was bad. I mean, I had no... As soon as I, like, went into that fight and I had no flash, I knew that was going to end poorly. Keep swimming, buddy. You might have to execute this one. Oh, you tried. You can do it, Yasuo. Just kill Tristana. Oh, shit. I just need a little bit of MR. Right, like, right now I need MR because Brand is pretty fed and Gragas is also going to be fighting me a lot. So there's a lot of magic damage that I'll be taking this game. And I just need like a little bit of MR to make sure that these guys don't like one-shot me, basically. Don't redemption that shit. I'm, I've obviously got her. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Now you don't have redemption up. <laughs> Why would you redemption that shit, man? God damn it. <laughs> oh, that's like a three minute cooldown for something I obviously had. <laughs> Such a waste, man. Oh, we just got two of us killed. I should have flashed a shockwave, honestly. That's all right. Like the redemption, the redemption play there, like that. that's not an optimal play. But that's not the reason I died there. Like, it prevents the optimal play, which would have led to me not dying. But at the same time, I could have just not died anyway by, just, like, flashing, so. I can't, like, just, like, tilt about the redemption because there's so much I could have done myself still. We seem to be losing, like, all the fights, but on the plus side, we have a lot of, like, tower pressure compared to these guys. Nice. I think she could have just ran there, but that's fine. <laughs>
We have enough damage to focus Gragas. Uh, okay, Lucian's, Lucian, Lucian's opting into the 1v1 top. Risky. He's probably still around top as well. Holy fuck. Oh, man. Did we just not realize that Tristan is there or something? <laughs> like, legit. She just right click Lucian and he just walked into him, like, not realizing she was there. Fuck. Well, we lost a 3v5, so that's pretty impressive. Uh, if, if we lose 3v5s, I don't think we deserve to win, honestly, do we? I'm pretty sure we didn't realize Tris was in the bush. We walked up to her and <laughs> without. Like, legit, I'm, I'm not 100% sure, but I've, I'm pretty sure. I, I saw Lucian, like, focusing someone here while Trish was just right-clicking him. Our team fighting is awful, we get caught all the time. This is one of the most sloppy games I think I've seen in ages. I already have Dragon, it's not good. God damn it, I pressed on you, it's too late. This game, though, innit? Oh fuck. I thought our early game was good enough to win that game. But yeah, we threw way too hard mid game. Our early game on Elise is <coughs> really good though. Like this is, every time we play Elise, we just destroy, um, we destroy the early game. So this isn't the first time this has happened, where we win early like really hard. How did I have the most damage on my team in a game that went 40 minutes and I'm playing Elise? Holy shit. I did better than I thought I did. I suicided a lot though. Which is